My tripod's broken, so I can't lower it, so I have to sit like this. So as you can see next to me, well, you actually can't see it. One sec. You can see it now, I think. Yeah, you can. You can't see much of me, though. So like four or so years ago, I was a giant fan of a bunch of old video games. I have a Super Nintendo, GameCube, Nintendo 64, and NES. And I have a good amount of games for each one. I always got my games at this low place close by that sold a bunch of old video games. And one game I've always wanted, but just never found there, was Super Mario 64. And I bought all these at the store besides the Nintendo 64. That game system was my mom's in the 90s, and she just gave it to me when I got more into a bunch of old games. And with that, she gave me a bunch of old games. One of them same property of Blockbuster. Have fun with that bill. But one game she couldn't find but remembered having was Super Mario 64. And a few days ago, she was trying to clean out the basement again. And guess what she found? Two games. One being Wave Race 64, which it's a cool game, but not what we're talking about. She found Super Mario 64. You can't see it that well. Super Mario 64. And if you're watching this, you probably know about the whole Wario and... Uh, cop the copies are personalized all that stuff and by what I read when I was looking into it most of the games were always kind of broken and just very old and my mom told me she got this on the release day and it was in a box in the basement that was thrown down steps three times by what I heard it's not the beta or whatever everyone's saying but I do think it could have a lot of weird stuff so I'm just gonna put it in and we're gonna play it As I was setting up the camera to put in front of the TV, I was on the phone with my mom and she was telling me about how she remembered getting it, has zero memory of actually playing it. Even though when I was talking to my grandma, she said she was playing this for a solid three years, always played it. It was her favorite game. She has no memory of actually playing it. Okay, got the controller. I'm going to put it in right now. You can't see much with the light, but uh, just right there. Okay. Y'all notice that? <laughs> okay, it's there. It was like out of sync or something. I don't know. It was delayed. I've really only played ports of this game. I've never actually played the actual version. Okay, here we go. I'll cut around the boring parts so it's not just a gameplay. Ooh, spooky. The princess must be inside. Oh, yeah, the princess. I'm making jokes, but if it actually, well, imagine if something actually does happen, I'd just be freaked out. Okay. I love the music. I'm just gonna say that. I love the music on this game. It's great. Is the game always like that? It's like very laggy. I don't know if y'all can see that. Like I know it's an old game, but I, I can barely control it. Okay, I got there. Alright. I have beat this guy before, just on like a port. I never actually fully played it on the Nintendo 64. That was a very easy fight. <laughs> Hey, got the first star. What? Wait, it froze? No, I just. As soon as I grabbed the star. Don't tell me I have to reset it. No. I don't want to. Wait. Yo, daddy, so. No! No! 